Does it bite? No, it is dead. Oh. If we're going to get married, we should get to know each other. Okay. What would you like to know? What type of music do you like? Whatever you like. No, you have to tell me, do you like rap music? Do you like a little Drake? Kanye West? Kanye! Okay. Well, it's tough to say you do not like Kanye West. I cannot say that I blame you. Now we're getting somewhere. What do you like to do for fun? Whatever you like. No. I know what I like to do, and I know that you know what I like to do, but I like to know what you like to do. For instance, do you have a favorite food? Yes. Good. What is it? Whatever you like. I command you to not obey me. I cannot disobey you, your highness. So you're telling me whatever I ask you to do, you will do? Yes. Okay, bark like a dog. Arf! Arf! A big dog. Woof! Woof! Okay, do the tootsie roll. Tootsie roll? Oh, you don't know how to do it? Mm -hmm. I will show you, come on, come on. To the left. To the left. To the right. To the right. To the front. To the front. To the back. To the back. Now dip, baby dip. Dip? Yes, now dip, baby dip. Like this? Yeah, exactly. Now, Wakanda forever. Oh. Wakanda okay. forever. Yeah. Wakanda forever. Okay. <laughs> it just wouldn't work out. We're too different. You're royalty, for Christ's sakes. You want me to renounce my throne? <laughs> I will now renounce my throne. From this moment on, I am no longer the Prince of Samunda. Does that make you happy? I can't let you do that. I do not care about my crown. All I care about is you, Lisa. Marry me. I don't know, Akeem. Cut! That was great. But there's no kiss in this scene. Well, I feel like if it was me, I would kiss her to make her stay. Right. But this is Eddie Murphy's biopic, not yours, Fresh Prince. Now, there was no kiss in this scene back then, so let's just stick to the script. Unless I tell you otherwise, okay? All right, my bad. All right. That's a wrap on rehearsal. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. Sorry about the kiss. It's cool. I knew where you were going with it. So, what's your story? What do you mean? Why are you obsessed with Eddie Murphy? <laughs> obsessed? That's a strong word. Who said that? People talk. And the word is, you want to be Eddie Murphy. Well, people need to stop talking. I'm not obsessed with Eddie Murphy. I'm not trying to be him. There can only be one Eddie Murphy. I've just admired him since his work since I was a kid. Look, come to find out we're both at Aries. His birthday is the day before mine. He's the reason I became an actor and a comedian. So once again, I'm not obsessed with him. I'm just simply celebrating him for all the great things he's done in this business and for paving the way for people like me. Okay, well, it's no judgment. And if I offended you, I'm sorry. Well, you could have fooled me. This is crazy. I can't believe we're on set about to do this movie. Thanks again for allowing me to be a part of this. I can't tell you how much this means to me, bro. Man, I ain't allow you to be a part of this. You earned this. So stop thanking me, okay? Look, this is what we talked about. Making our own way and looking out for each other. And when the world sees the work you put in this film, you're gonna be a movie star. And this is gonna be a classic. No right? Coming to America? And you know they're gonna wanna make a part two, bro. Yeah, right? You already know. You remember you used to wanna go to McDonald's? And you'd be like, Mom, I wanna go to McDonald's. She said, Mama, I can make you some McDonald's burgers. She said, Mom, you can? So Mama said, Grandma has me the green peppers and onions. She said, McDonald's ain't got no green peppers and onions in it. And she gave the burger and it looked like this. She's like, wait a minute. This got green peppers and onions. McDonald's don't make no green peppers and onion burger. And it's dripping all down your arm and you're like, Ooh, Ooh. that's not a McDonald's burger, Mama. She said, boy, go eat that burger. And you said, yes, ma'am. Gus, what is this? You come on my house every year, Gus, and you burn down my house, Gus. You burn down my house. We're not cooking Bonasaurus burgers, Gus. We're cooking Franks and hot dogs, man. You got Charlie over there rolling with third degree burns. Stop burning down my house, Gus. And your wife, she can't walk a flight of stairs to save her life. She's a Bigfoot. I know she's a Bigfoot, Gus. Because I took your kids fishing, and I, they dipped their head in the water, and they came up with fish and looked at each other and said, Goonie Goo Goo. I said, What the? So I told my friend Sanchez, I thought it was some Spanish. I said, Hey, Goonie Goo Goo. He said, Man, get the heck out of here. Your wife's the Bigfoot, Gus. I'm telling you, your wife's the Bigfoot. <clears throat> I'm about to get in the hot tub. I'm about to get in the hot tub. It's too hot. It's too hot. I can't get in the hot tub. I said, I can't get in the hot tub. <laughs>